Hey guys, welcome to an episode of Cooking with the Reaper, your heavy metal chef. Hey, got an exciting recipe for you guys tonight. We're going to do an authentic carbonara. All right. We got our uh, pancetta in the frying pan here, and it's cold. Put it in the cold pan, guys. And you want to put it on a low heat. Because you want it low and slow. Then we get the oils out of there. Got our water on, getting ready to boil. And you need four eggs. You know, and been an argument through throughout history. Yolk or no yolk? Or white or no white? Well, you know, use the whole egg. Solves the argument. All right. Get this all blended together real nice. And I got my uh, fresh grated pecorino Romano over here. We're going to make our cream without cream. We're using all natural stuff, guys. This is about a half a pound. And it was fun trying to grade that, you know. Let me just get this all blended together. Good to be with you guys again. It's been a crazy day. Went to four different stores to get some pancetta. Nobody has it. And since it's, you know, the Italian stores were closed. So we got this. We're gonna add pepper. Carbonara. You know, in Rome, they like their pepper. Carbonara means charcoal. This uh, recipe originated from the mines. So I'm hoping that we get enough oil from our pancetta. Sometimes you have to help it out with a little extra virgin olive oil. But we want to fry this up low and slow. We want it to get crispy, guys. Crispy. Mm -hmm. Looks like we got some good oil going, but I'm going to add just... About a half a teaspoon of extra virgin olive oil. And we get a 
wait for our water to come up to temp here because we actually need our pasta water for this, guys. We don't want it, you know, we don't want scrambled eggs, so we got to do it the right way. All right? And while we're waiting on our pancetta to fry up, I'll be back with you shortly. Stick around. Guys, you want to take some of this pasta water because this is egg. You don't want scrambled eggs, guys. All right? I'm going to put about one and a half ladles in there, all right? This is going to get it all coming together without making scrambled eggs. But this is going to dissolve the cheese, guys. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and guys, when you're making this, you don't want to use that Romano that's in the in the in the can. It's already grated. It doesn't dissolve. All right. You want a fresh grate. About eight bucks for the block. All right. Look at that, guys. Came together nice, didn't it? Alright, good to have Gunji with us again. I had to wake him up from his nap. Alright. Look how creamy that is now. And this is gonna thicken up too. When we put it in the pan. So, got our water boiling. I didn't put a lot of salt in there, guys, because this this cheese is salty enough. All right, one pound of pasta. And don't discard your water because we're going to use this. All right. We're gonna do this El Dante thing about, about 10 minutes with this brand. Oh yeah, look at that. Pancetta, it's coming together. Oh yeah, that's the way you want it, guys. It's browning up nice. Get a lot of wonderful flavors out of this pack. This is authentic governor. Not what you get at Domino's. There's fast food chains. This is what was made in the old school. Got a few minutes for our pasta to get ready, guys. So until then, be right back. Right, now that's the way you want your pancetta, guys. The heat, I turned it off, okay? Gotta turn the heat off for a little bit. Get your noodles, get your spaghetti in there. And don't fling it all over the stove. Like I'm doing. Yeah. yeah. Uh oh. Typical Reaper fashion. Woohoo! When it's hot. Yeah, we'll leave that there. We'll get it later. Never a dull moment, guys. Hey. That's a pound of pasta. I do 
do have a pasta for it, but I just like using my tongs for some reason. Alright. I'm gonna take about a half a ladle. Just gonna throw it right in there, guys. Got this back on a low temp. This is the million million dollar deal here, guys. Because you don't want to scramble. You don't want scrambled eggs. Right? That's why we have one. Turn around, guys. Oh, look at how creamy that is, guys. Oh, yeah. Authentic cabanero. You want to keep stirring it, guys. Bunch of cheese to melt. You don't want scrambled eggs. Oh yeah. It's looking good. Looking good. But, uh, hey guys, don't forget, like, and don't forget to subscribe. And this, it's free to subscribe, guys. You'd be doing us a courtesy. Awesome. All right, but we're going to give this a couple more minutes, guys. We're going to get this plated. Stick around. We'll be right back. Oh yeah, there you have it guys, authentic carbonara, some fresh grated pecorino on there, but there you have it guys, I'd like to thank you again for being with us here on Cooking with the Reaper, your heavy metal chef. And until next time, guys, God bless, and uh, stay safe out there. Ciao.